and we're back and this time I'm going to show you how to create a cool emoji design in Adobe Illustrator. So the starting point is under view the smart guides and snap to point I activate it and we'll use the ellipse tool hold shift when you drag a circle. Let me align it to the center. I'll make it yellow, orange. Let me make it a little bit more yellowish. Something like that should be fine. The next element is the mouth. We can create that with the line segment tool. Swap the colors, make the stroke black, hold shift when you drag that, increase the stroke weight, make sure that it's aligned to the center as well. And now we'll use the anchor point tool, go to the center and drag it downwards to create the curvature. Afterwards, we can use the width tool, go to the center position, click and then drag upwards. So it gets thicker in the center and thinner on the outside. Make sure it's still selected, then open your stroke menu. You will find that under window and give it a round cap. So that was easy so far, a little bit more complex. Are the sunglasses? We can use the rectangle tool first. Swap the colors to have a black fill and no stroke. Use the selection tool and hold all to drag a copy out of it. I select both and then I give it the full black color. Then right click group and align it. Let me ungroup it and I get rid of one side. And we'll work on the left one. Use the direct selection tool, click on the anchor point and then drag the curvature inwards. I'm going to do that on both bottom anchor points in different degrees. And now we just need the pen tool. So we can't get around it. Well, let's just use this anchor point, create a new one diagonally and another one, but this time click and drag to create a curved line. Go back to the last anchor point, click on it, that way it's released. And then again, click and drag to create a curved one. And again, go back, left click to release it. Let me zoom in and you can see what I'm doing. And the final one. I'll just place it right at the end point, right here at the right top and create another curvature, so click and drag. So that looks like something we can work with. Again, we need the pen tool. Go to the next anchor point, diagonally upwards, and then click and drag. Something like that should be fine. Release it, so go back to the last anchor point, left click, go upwards. I guess that was too high. Let me press Ctrl Z to undo that and I zoom in. And then left click, left click again and drag for the last one to create another curvature. All right, it doesn't look too shabby. We can use that. Select the sunglasses. Oh, that was my mistake. Obviously select both elements, or all elements in this case. I deselect the yellow one while holding shift and left clicking on it. And then I hold alt and drag a copy out of the sunglass element. Then right click, transform reflect. Reposition that. But this Anchor point on top, I don't like it, 
So we uh, gotta do something about that. And the best way to deal with it is to just connect both shapes with the shape builder tool first. Let me drag the yellow circle out of it. Then I select both elements, use the shape builder to connect them. And now you can use the selection tool and drag this curvature tool inwards to make it more round. Alright, that looks fine. Maybe I'll give it a different color. And I give the mouth a different color as well. Make sure everything is aligned once more and you're done creating this cool emoji design in Adobe Illustrator. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.